Hi, so this is the question which I have practiced today. Uh, that is string compression. So the question is very simple. Uh, it's a medium level question. Uh, so we would be given an input string, uh, input an array where it would be like this. Let's say A, A, B, 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 D. Let's say this is an input uh, array is given. So we have to do a string compression. So means what we have to do is the compression would be like A is coming how many times? Two times. B is coming how many times? Three times. So B three times. D is coming how many times? One time. So for one we don't have to write. So we have to write D. Okay. If only if we have more than one then only we have to write that count. Otherwise only one time we have to write. Right. So what we have to do is ultimately we have to put this into the same array. So the same array would be like a two, then B three and then D. So what is the new size of this array? The new size of this array would be one, two, three, four, five, five earlier. The array size was one, two, three, four, five, six. After compression, we have to return what is what would be the new array size. So it would be five, right? So we don't have to take any space complexity. We don't have to take any space, extra space, right? And after compression, whatever uh, we we will come up with this, we have to put into the same array. And one thing you have to know is that let's say uh, it is like if a 12 or a 13 means a is repeating 13 times. Let's say why a, 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 like this 13 times it is repeating. So when we put into an array, it should be like this a, then it's not like 13. It's like one, three, one, three, like this. So 13, they will take separate spaces in an array. Okay. So this is an equation. And if you think that this is the solution, which I have uh, written, which beats 99.46 and to be honest, I was writing the brute force solution first with this, but this brute force itself turned out to be an efficient one. I'll tell you my approach, uh, how brute force I was thinking. So let's say that let's just think from very basic. If you have been given this array simple, let me not use. Let me just simply write a, 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 b, b, d, and let's say f, f, let's say you have been given this array. So, and we can't take extra space. Okay. So one thing we, that one thing is that I have to iterate for sure. Right. So let's say I is my index where I would be used for iterating and the another point which I thought is okay. I cannot take extra space. I have to update the same array and then find out the size uh, of the new array. So means I need another index. Let's say I have uh, taken an index name as new index. Let's say or here. Let's say new I let's say new index, which will point to like currently at what index I have to put the value. Okay. So like wherever this new I is pointing to means at that place I can update it. Okay. So this was my initial thought. Okay. Now I, what I have to do is I have to make this I iterate. Okay. So first what I did is, okay, this is the letter which I have to compress a. Okay. Letter to compress is a. Now I am iterating this I till it is I am finding a, 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 a. So my I become this. Okay. The count will become like here it is one then two. Then again, I become this. It is again same. So count become three. Then I become this here. Now here it is not equals to a. Okay. So I have to stop here. So now what I have to do, I have to update 
my new index so new index here i have to put like what is the letter i have to compress a so in the new index i will update it to a so i will update it to a so this is i will overwrite it a N new index plus plus new index new i index plus plus now the second i need to point like okay count i have to put it here but here again if it is let's say 14 14 times it is repeating then i have to write one and four separately not in a sim similar one so again for 14 also i have to iterate one and then four you can convert it to a string and then iterate so but it is only three right only one so overwrite it to three new index plus plus so this is my new index currently pointing to and i is currently here okay now again a count will become zero now i will start so the letter to compute is now b so now it is again b and the count is zero so again it will iterate from here so count will become one i plus plus again it is b count will become two i plus plus then here it become d now it is not same the letter is to compress so means i have to update so the letter to comp uh, compress b is has to be updated into this one so i will update b here new index plus plus and i have to put the count so count is i have to again iterate so only one time two comes so it will put two here new index plus plus okay okay so you got it right what i am doing so in the same manner we have to be done like so the, i am doing the same way so here if you see i am iterating over this i taking out which letter to compress count is currently zero right and now i am iterating this i till i am com continuously finding this the letter which i have to compress and incrementing my count and i plus plus as soon as any letter i found which is not equivalent to the letter which i am compressing i have to now update so i'll update to the new index whatever the character right and then i have to put a count for the if count is greater than one if count is only one then we have to only write the letter itself if count is greater than one two or three then we have to write the count okay so now i have uh, converted that count to a string iterating over this count a string and putting that value again so let's say if it is 32 32 times it is repeating so i will put three and then two in an array okay so this is the code which i am running and at last wherever the new index is pointing to means till that array size i have reached right so i am returning that new array size okay so time complexity here is big o of n space complexity is big o of one I am thinking that you might ask a question uh, like Shreyansh why it is big O of n that okay one time we are iterating here that's all okay. So this inner while loop is nothing but again we are iterating the same array only because we are incrementing i plus plus. No element is repeating twice. Okay so this is big O of n but only at this point you might ask a question that hey Shreyansh you are converting to a string to an array right for this count and we are iterating over this will this not get counted in this big o of n so here why it's i am thinking it's big o of n is now let's say that let's consider this scenario a a b b c c d d let's say n equals to 10 e e right so if whenever count is greater than one then only i am going inside this right so now let's say if n equals to 10 and for each letter you have you have to go inside right a2 b2 c2 d2 e2 for each letter i have to go inside this loop okay and i have one i which is iterating and i have one new index also which is iterating okay so one is definitely big go of n times i am iterating right here now here how many times i will go inside this n by two times right so in this case worst case i will go inside n by two times so every letter is of two two times 
If it is one one time, I won't even go inside. Only for greater than one, I have to write like this. If it is one, I have to write only like this. So maximum I would go inside this loop is n by two times, and that in that case also my new index will is increasing. New index is increasing, right? So I will put the value and my new index is increasing. So what I am thinking it it's not. What I think might be people are thinking is that it big of n square. What I am thinking is it might be big of two times, like uh, two times of big O of n, right? Uh, one for index i and one for new index where I am increasing because whenever the I have to go inside this, uh, whenever I have to go inside this list, I am writing into the new index. So it's kind of again iterating. But I it will not iterate like big O of n into big O of n. For each character, I am not iterating everything again. Max, I would be iterating two times of big O of n. So ultimately, it would be big O of n only. Right? What do you think? So that's my uh, approach that it would be a big O of n, not big O of n square. Uh, many engineer might get confused over here. But yeah, I would like to hear your thought also. Thank you, team. Bye.